You're very, very welcome. Round three of the 2024 BRC 110th Off-Road Nationals. This time from Stotfold, renowned for its bumps and its pacey locals. I know Alex Carter is going to be looking for an A-final. That's for sure. Here is your track. So it looks like we're going in straight this way up onto your 90 degree tabletop and bumpy top corner and around I cannot stress how bumpy that surface is it's very camouflaged I know there's a big one out there somewhere I'm not sure quite where I remember from a couple of years ago nice simple track layout it's not going to be the layout that's going to ruin your day it's going to be the bumps okay let's get down and take a look so before I start the track walk, of course, big thanks to Schumacher Speedworks Model Tune, Rude Bits, FF Racing, SEMCS and Briefcase Graphics. They are our sponsors for the year. Big thanks to them, as always. You're used to hearing that now, I'm sure. Right, we're down the straight. First corner looks okay. There's a little bit of a bump there in the Astro just on entry. I think it'll be okay. I think we saw Michael Orlowski go around here on two wheels a couple of years ago. Probably due to that bump. He saved it. He hung on to it. It didn't look likely at one point, but he hung on to it. Now, nice little pop over this tabletop. You might get just a touch of the down ramp at the apex. Left and right. Now, not pleasant. Not pleasant at all. It's okay right in at the hose. It's not okay anywhere else. There's a tree root, or maybe that's man-made, I can't tell. Lots of lumps. And secondary lump here, down onto a change of astro. You know, the worst combinations. But it's a challenge, you know, it's the same for everybody. Then you're around, fast right-hander out over more bumps then it sort of smoothens out a bit and we are going left running parallel with the front of the rostrum no big issue tabletop short down ramp so probably a flat landing I would say doesn't really look like much of a useful down ramp anyway Maybe, maybe it's okay actually. Let's see. Left hander keeping in, lots of bumps on the outside, horrible. And then a chicane, we're turning left and we're turning right. Track layout pretty simple, but it's the bumps that makes it. Now, here's the interesting bit. From this point up and all the way down to that tabletop over there is going to be the making of your lap, I think. Because it's one long continuous bend and it's got a major elevation change. So let's take a look out of this corner. It initially tightens here over all this well, actually, it doesn't look too bumpy. It looks worse than it is. It looks a lot worse than it is. Up the hill, it's bumpy and uneven at the crest. Now, it's how you make hay here. There's your line through. And there's bumps on the down ramp. Oh, I think it's just trying to straighten it up and fire it down. I don't know what else you can do. I don't know what else, it feels soft underfoot, it feels lumpy underfoot. I don't know. We'll have to see what the top guys do. Back up. This, what looks was a tabletop, sort of a tabletop, into this left hand hairpin which folds away quite a lot. Downhill. A little bit of banking here if you want to try and use that, not sure. How they're going to do that, I'd say it'd just be neat and tidy. 
and then we have a smoothish bit up onto the wall ride plenty of rubber has been laid down here it's been used for a while hairpin on the wall ride and then we have tabletop and tabletop seen that quite a few times no issues and just get it planted and back down onto the straight okay look there it is it's not a super technical layout but it's the bumps so let's see how it goes good news is, is that sky is blue wonderful it's a bit cool by 12 degrees at the moment it's only seven o'clock in the morning join us later on for a finals and news and whatever i can gather up thanks for watching